we've been reporting from Tawang. And uh, I want you to take a look at this report that I filed uh, from the Sela Pass about the army actually strengthening defences all along Arunachal Pradesh. Take a look at this report. The Indian Army successfully pushed back the Chinese soldiers at Yangtze, but the army is clearly taking no chances given China's actions not just at Yangtze in Arunachal Pradesh, but also the build-up at Doklam uh, opposite Sikkim, the build-up in Ladakh. The army is also strengthening its defences all along the line of actual control. We are currently at the Sela Pass at an altitude of 13,700 feet. And as you can look around me, there is military movement in terms of deployment of our forces at the line of actual control and other places uh, for the defense of our country. A lot of winter stalking taking place before uh, the pass here shuts down. This is the Sela Pass. It's already started snowing here. But in a while from now, the pass will also shut down. And as you can look around, there are multiple military vehicles and convoys that are moving, uh, that are carrying military equipment, soldiers, hardware um, and troops to different locations. The army is also working ex extensively on inter-valley and intra-valley movement of troops so that each time troops do not go back to Tezpur and then come up uh, in different parts of Arunachal Pradesh. And this is where Army and Air Force joint operations will play a very crucial role. The exercises that the Indian Air Force carried out also form a part of joint operations with the Army to ensure better protection of Arunachal Pradesh and the entire eastern sector in the face of the threat posed by expansionist forces like China. With cameraman Yogendra Singh, at the Sela Pass at an altitude of 13,700 feet in Arunachal Pradesh, Gaurav Savant for India Today.